Well, to start the story off, I think I met Willem, what, five, six years ago? Yeah, it would have been that. At, the, at this dam. And um, back then I knew absolutely nothing about these fish. It was like me playing follow the leader. I went back into the sticks with him and it was like overwhelming, you know. And this morning we launched and I was like too eager to even um, do a little spiel. Like it was a glass out and everything was perfect. And I was like, like <laughs> we got to go. Picture perfect. Yeah. yeah. Pulled up on the flat and it was just, there was just backs and barra and it was really cool I'll to tell you what I have been fishing for barra for a long time and I have never ever seen anything like this Maddie. Yeah. Very cool. It's very cool. What we did today is very unique and it's it's something special. You you you've, yeah. you've cottoned onto something pretty cool here man. And it takes like it's got its little little niche. It's still it's still hard like you can't just go there and go to him. Oh there's a barra I'm going to catch no. it. There's a lot more to it. Yeah. There's a lot of small things that you need to get right to make that mm. stuff happen what we did today yeah but that after this afternoon i don't know if you can see we've got this is one of the first storms i've fished in for the year we've, this is what we've been waiting for you know like even willem said for years and years this is it yeah this is the pinnacle of barra fishing you got a storm in the background and we went back into the sticks and found a little weed oh, pocket and mate it was on we would have seen 50 fish today yep. that's no exaggeration and I think in the end we ended up with seven or something, but yeah. Maddie put on a masterclass. <laughs> <laughs> it's different it's when cool. you watch it on TV and then when you see it in happening real life. in front of you, it's yeah. phenomenal. Yeah, yeah it, it is pretty special. Mm. The whole thing, the whole side casting thing, and when you see the fish come up and he eats it, you're like, oh wow. You know, keep him within five meters of the boat. Yeah. Which is weird. Like, who, to, to who see him, thinks to, to see him know, come up and eat at the rod tip mm. is special man you don't yeah. see that every day hey no so yeah today we had a cracking day um definitely worth a watch and uh hope you enjoy it they're my friends little berries my little friends. He stays up. <sighs> Perfect. Let's get this done. That's, I think I just saw his, yeah, his tail. He's coming towards us. We are seeing Barra everywhere. That's what, five? So we've got, we're, we're kind of there. surrounded. So we've got, there's another one at the back. That's crazy. <laughs> no <laughs> pressure, but big pressure. No, we got this. You know, a day like today, we should see this all day long. There he is. He's still up, cruising. That's another one. Oh, my word. Oh, just so straight in front of me. Straight, yep, yep, he's yep. heading, he's aiming left, so he's coming. Yep. Go, yep. Burn it, burn it, burn it, burn it. Twitch it. Twitch it. Twitch it. No. Just do, just do. So, yeah, go, go, go. To him. Right. Okay, stay. I'll get my feelers. Yeah, yeah. You make it. So I've go. blown a couple of fish, but to see him get up this high and in these numbers, that fish was like a meter six. Wow. A meter seven. Yeah, no, this is cool. This is next level cool. Slowly, wind, 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 wind. Sink. Twitch it, twitch it, twitch it. Good. Yo! Dude, that was insane! <laughs> yeah, buddy. How good was that? Dude, that, that was cool. cool. Sub meter fish. I reckon he's a 90. Hey, what have you done? No, I'm just, I'm just getting warmed up. I'll finish with a 1.3. You should know yeah. that by now. No, <laughs> well, now we do. <laughs> How good is that, man? 
Wow. That is so cool to see him, to see him on the surface, and then to put a cast in and watch him come eat. To just right spend, at your feet, and to spend the is, last like three days hunting, and oh, then to jump on the water and hunt Barra. Oh, <laughs> magic. Dude, 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 dude. Cheers, bro. Thank you so much, man. Epic. Right, track left, left. Are you blind? That was pretty cool. Oh, he's a bit sick. He's a big fish, but he's a, he's like, if you actually look, he's blind just about in both eyes. So I'll just like slowly show you his size and get him back in the water. He's probably like a metre three, metre four. He's pretty good for being blind, like, shit, he's not bad. At least he's got plenty of go still. One on one. Yeah, that's a fish. This, that one, the big one that we're after is kind of like in front. To him. That's all right. Bring it right, bring it right. Bring it, bring it. Stop. Twitch it. Twitch it. Yep. Oy! Twitch it. Switch it. Yep. In the way now. Noises. <laughs> That's pretty cool. That was crazy. Oh my god. How did you like that? And he kind of spoke, but like a, you know, like a pig. He, he spoke, but he didn't know why. So he came up and then went off. Yum. Like it wasn't anything. Because we didn't keep going and pushing him.
the experiences I've had in a very long time. I have not seen anything like this. And it's the same, same rig. It's a BKK Kajiki hook in a 6.0 on a white hold prawn. And it just works, man. Clearly. <laughs> it is so good. We got a storm brewing in the background now. I think we're going to have to do a runner. Oh, yeah. But I can't thank you enough for taking Mary so much fun it's a good fish <sighs> that is a perfect example of barra fishing we've got storms we've got hungry fish we're going to outrun it now but that last little we said one more trip and that cloud is coming to eat us up it's getting, <laughs> it's getting back yeah it's getting here he goes <laughs>